Faro market is open, it's heaving with tourists and locals. I'm shopping for my salad and the ingredients look amazing. I'm ready to shop, check it out. Okay. It's early morning and I've come for first pickings and I'm selecting colorful ingredients. So deciding my recipe after I shop, I'm selecting cabbages that look red and the contrast with the peppers and all that. So. so oranges are in season and I can't wait to put these in my salad. This is gonna give the salad a pungent flavor and a sweet. And I'm going to make a raspberry, a ruby grapefruit vinaigrette. This is gonna give the uh, salad an amazing flavor. Let's do it. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. So buying local produce like I did is very important. It's fresh ingredients, early morning, and I'm ready to make my salad. Now back from the market, I'm preparing dinner and it's beef bourguignon. This salad is gonna counter the acidity of the sauce, the wine sauce. So I'm mixing colors and I'm going to make a raspberry vinaigrette to dress this salad. Let's start with chopping these. I'm not gonna use the entire head of lettuce. I'm only gonna take half and only using the top part that is very colorful, very seductive. And now I'm gonna add some more color with these beautiful yellow cherry tomatoes. Absolutely beautiful. And this beautiful red cabbage is going to give the salad this brilliant, beautiful purple color that is going to reflect the beef bourguignon. Oh wow, look at this color. That's absolutely beautiful. And now for the blood red grapefruit raspberry vinaigrette that I'm gonna dress this salad with. That's gonna give it a tangy taste and a beautiful crunch. dash of white wine and vinegar, a little bit more. And lots of olive oil, about four tablespoons. Pinch of salt, pinch of chili flakes. Oh, amazing. That's enough. And it's ready to be plated. If you're wondering what I'm going to do with these, And last but not least, a bit of crunch with toasted chestnuts. 